Thailand is from uh, Stanley. Uh, welcome to my hometown. Uh, I think you have know the name already. It's the Luoyang City. And uh, please allow me to introduce myself and uh, our driver first. My name is Joe. English name is Joe. J O E. And uh, I think uh, most of you can speak Chinese, right? Yeah. No? <laughs> no, that's good. <laughs> You know, if everybody is speaking Chinese, so I'm not cheap. He <laughs> You're gonna just need a Chinese guy. And uh, my na English name is Zhu because uh, my Chinese surname is Zhu. Uh, and you were from Beijing, right? The first station, station, Beijing. So you know, in Beijing, in Ming and Qing Dynasty, Beijing was the capital of China. And uh, in Ming Dynasty, at that time, all the members of Imperial family their surname was Zhu. Uh, so we are, we are in the same family, very powerful family in China. <laughs> and uh, you know, uh, two, about two years ago, I got my English name that was Joey, J-O-E-Y, J-O-E-Y. But uh, two foreigners, they told me, Joey, that means baby kangaroo. <laughs> you know, I don't... <laughs> oh yeah, straight out, maybe yeah, I think so. I don't, I don't want to be a kangaroo, <laughs> but I don't want to be a baby forever. <laughs> so that's not good. I changed my English name from Joey to Jill. J O E. It's an uh, American Navy soldier, right? <coughs> I want to be more strong. Uh, that's it. That will be better. Okay, from here to the Norman Girls House is about uh, uh, only 10 minutes. And before the caves, before the Norman Girls House, we, we will have lunch first. And uh, of course, you are so hungry, I think. Uh, this morning, what time did you leave Xi'an? 8.30. Uh, you know, in China, traffic is sometimes not so good. Uh, the expressway, the highway you took today, from Xi'an to Luoyang, you know, from the first day, it's uh, it's always being repaired. <laughs> you know, from the first day, because you know, from Xi'an to Luoyang, uh, there are a lot of coal mine, coal mines. So a lot of very big, very huge trucks uh, to be that way. That's the reason they always fix the expressway quite often. And uh, <coughs> over here. Uh, this area we call that uh, is new site of Luoyang, <coughs> new part of Luoyang. And uh, before you come to my hometown, come to China, and, uh, I want to know how much do you know about uh, this city? Nothing. Nothing. Zero. <laughs> you are very honest, but you hurt me. <laughs> you know Luoyang city is very famous in China. In China, we always say, you want to know the history about uh, China for 30 years. Uh, the best choice is Shenzhen. A city is very close to Shenzhen because about 30 years ago, that was a small village. Only the country was there. China, we had the open door. Why in Royal City now we cannot see uh, 
some very pretty planet in the city. Like the bird, like the city wall, the Tarot Palaces, Forbidden City, and that. Uh, because Loyang was chosen by uh, as ca capital more than thousand meters ago. And uh, over here, uh, because Loyang is not only famous for tourism, but also factories in Loyang city. We have a lot of very huge factories. The big one, the biggest one. There are together more than 100,000. 100,000 workers inside. One factory. So, uh, let me look at the to the inside of the we are now to the new part of 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 the new part we are trying our best to make this country more beautiful and much better. Uh, I hope you come back to my hometown in about 5 years, uh, maybe 10 years ago. Change. Change your thoughts, I'm sure. You know, because the local, local government we, um, wants to build to the new site, so we moved uh, about 6 villages. Six villages out of this area in the field in the new because you know, we need we, we need land, farmland and living land to build these buildings. So we look in the village. But uh, we need to build some buildings for them to live. So buildings like that. Only seven stories cannot sold out. Uh, it's only for the local farmers. So for them we have a very good, very special policy. Like a building like that, the apartment is about uh, 100 square meters. Each one, every apartment is only 3,100. 300. Thank you. 
But in Buddhism, the, the monks, the Buddhists always teach people if you practice Kung Fu, uh, sorry, uh, Buddhism, very hard. Next generation, after people die, they will do their things in heaven and over there. They will have very, very hard life. Very good life. So, some people take into Buddhism and try it. Also, uh, we have a lot of reasons about that. The other way, you know, very very fast, maybe follow the other way to Shaolin Temple. The no main turtles is just uh, one work of that. Uh, in 1915, a lot of emperors, they believed in Buddhism. So they built a lot of uh, very huge constructions and uh, carved a lot of caves. The no main turtles is just uh, one of them. China, we have three very big things. Lowman is one of that. Today, they are all together more than 100,000. 100,000 statues left. And uh, altogether 2,345 clips of them. So today, if you want to see that one by one, it's very difficult. So first, you know, yeah, for one, one more way. What is that? Tomorrow, uh, tomorrow morning, we will make a very late time, 9 o'clock or 9.30. Because tomorrow we have only one time shopping. So come to Luoyang, maybe you have a shopping time. Okay, uh, it's just uh, the front of our...